Ever wonder how to do a nice transition with Bezier built into Premiere in the effects? If I go here and I bring in a wipe effect and I put it right on this transition point, basically between two different types of slides, you can see it looks a classic linear wipe. Let's do it again a little slower. Classic linear wipe. Very boring. I like a more of a bouncy one. And unfortunately, there's no settings there. If I look at these settings, there's just nothing that says like, do it, do it as a Bezier. So I'm gonna get rid of that. So what I typically do, let me zoom this in a little bit, is I want it to basically start, I want the transition to start here. So what I want to happen is I want this image right here, the one on the right side, to come over the one on the left. So the way I do that is I take a screenshot of that. Let me go back to my project viewer. My project viewer, there's the file. And I grab it and I drag it over the top. So I want my transition to start about here and end about there. So what I do is I make sure first I have the, the image on top that I wanna bring in. And I wanna bring it in left to right so what I do is I make my position and I mark it there with a keyframe and I, it starts at 960 by default. So I say minus 960, which puts it exactly off the screen. Then I go about two seconds to maybe there. I put another keyframe 960. And now basically I have the same effect as I had before. It's just a linear transition that moves in. Very boring. So the way to fix that is I is I expand the position that gives me my velocity. So you can see it immediately starts moving, 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 and immediately stops. That's linear. So I can say right mouse button, temporal interpolation, Bezier, start and stop the same way, temporal interpolation, Bezier. Now, what I wanna do is I grab the inside dot, I pull it down so that it starts at zero, and then I go all the way as far as I can go, which brings it to the center. Do the same thing with the out. So now, as I bring it together and I let go, this basically says it goes slow, 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 fast, 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 slow, slow, slow. So now when I run this, you can see it'll jump in slowly, then jump out slowly, it goes fast in the middle. And I can vary that by just how far apart I put these two things. Sometimes you lose it and you have to re-click on the keyframe. So now it's gonna start out zero and then speed up a little quicker and then slow down at the end not as sudden but you know my preference is i like fast so i'm going to put it here in the middle and the other thing is if you know i said before it doesn't really matter how big you make this jpeg you can move these keyframe these keyframes together and it doesn't really matter how big this is because as I scroll through here, it's not gonna move until I hit the keyframe, then it's gonna move slow, fast, slow again. So that's basically it. Hope this helps.